All right, folks, ladies and gentlemen, an all-new episode of Wrestling Outlaws. You don't want to miss, and don't go to sleep just yet. I know it's midnight, but hang on tight. It's going to be an interesting one. Nelson Torres here, along with Caroline Stewart. Hey, guys, how's it going? Yeah, please convince them it's midnight. Don't sleep yet. Not just for a good good few minutes. Yeah, and an hour, maybe, depending on if you're in Bronxnet. Joining along with us is WTF United Continental Champion, Happy to Clown. Hey, what's up, everyone? Yeah. We're about to unveil something very unique that's going to knock everyone's socks off, including Happy's. Maybe. And, and Caroline's. Yeah. You don't mm -hmm. want to miss it. So with that, Wrestling Outlaws starts about right now. All right, folks, Nelson Torres here along with Caroline Stewart. Wrestling Outlaws is on the air. That is right. Once again, how are you doing? Caroline Stewart here, and thank you for tuning in to WTF Wrestling Outlaws. And if you're watching this on YouTube, thank you so much. Like, subscribe, share, and hit that bell for notifications. Yeah, exactly. I love you, Caroline. Yeah, that's what I do. You're a lovable cunt, as you like to say. I am. I'm a cunt with a clit of gold. Believe Ooh. me, I know. Huh? <laughs> Some people think they do know, but they don't, right? <laughs> yeah, it's like the Ark of the Covenant, you know. He survived. You have to unravel it, too. Yeah, he survived. I was worthy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And yeah. speaking of who is actually being worthy of everything, the WTF United Continental Champion, Happy the Clown. Yeah. I'm not going to call myself the icon. I could call myself the ass kicker. I could call myself the realest dude in the room. But I would never call myself the icon. But An icon is like a huge status, right? It's quite a title. Yeah, it's, 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 it's self-egotistical. But we're not going to go there with that. Because <laughs> some people might get their feelings hurt. Yeah, mm. and we're going to debate on, uh, talk about, about a so-called debate or a face-off that's happening now it's past midnight, later today, later tonight, actually Friday night. Mm -hmm. well, if you guys have anything, anything to do on Friday night at around 7 p.m., live Eastern on YouTube, a face-off between Angelo Razorblade Vega, United Continental Champion, and Tyler Cage. Yep. We're going to discuss a little bit of that. Yeah, that's... Uh, it's not even a wrestling match. This it's is just a... a straight-on debate. It's uh, not even a physical match. We... Okay, so we're doing a debate. So we're Yeah, tomorrow night. What are mm -hmm. they debating about? Well, but they've been talking about it for the last couple of weeks. We'll show some... Uh, uh, they had some pre-recorded comments about what's going to happen tomorrow. Wait a minute, is that the bucket of AIDS thing you told me? That the bucket of AIDS. Yes. You know, I'm, I'm sorry, the, but... The controversial bucket statement of... that is the bucket, the bucket of, of AIDS. The bucket of AIDS. I thought it was the Anarchy 69. I, I thought that was it right there also. I mean, I'm... Did I just put fuel to the fire? Yes, I did. Yes, so, and but to, before we go any further with that debate, let's talk about the time that you won the United Continental Championship. Yeah, um, being honest, I didn't want the belt. I don't like belts, but I was put in by management, the uppers. You were wrestling against was, Nightmare yeah. for the championship. Yeah, he and, was champion at the time. Oh yeah, and he well deserved it. He mm -hmm. well deserved it. Fought through the rankings, got to where he's at. I knew the man for years. Um, I think that was one of his last matches because of complications to his body. And now I more respect towards him now that he actually did what he did while he was suffering. He, even though you lost the match, it was, good. it was good to be in the ring with you. And we salute you at WTF. Of and he's we always do. welcome to come here anytime. The yeah. door is always open. The door is always open. Yeah. Unlike some people we know. Yes. So with that, we're going to show that match right now that you that we're speaking of. And right after that, shortly after, we're going to unveil the new design of the WTF United Continental Championship. And we're going to give little fun, little fun facts about the WTF. The championship's been around since 2015, almost nine years now, right? Yeah, just about. Yeah, and the first champion, believe it or not, Mr. Icon himself, Angela Vega. <sighs> Yeah. Yes, we know, we yeah, know. And it's, know. it's supposed to be the United Continent, the United States Championship and the United Continental Championship combined. If, if it had a baby, as you can't believe it. Yes, if, you know, it had a drunk one-night stand and she kept the kid. Yeah. Yeah, it's right here. So we'll discuss that. But first, let's just show that match that Happy the Clown talked about in its entirety. So let's check it out. Well, let's have something else. I, I think he needs a new makeup artist. I think it's something that's wearing off. <laughs> now, now, boys, boys. We can laugh. 
laugh and kiki all we want. He is the current. Oh, no, my, my, my nephew went up against him, and uh, from what my nephew said, he's a, he's a pretty dangerous guy. I'll give him that. I'll give him that. Give him credit when it's due. He knows what he's doing. You know, he Power bomb, I swear, lasted three seconds in the air. Bro. It was crazy. This match looks Our like it's going to be really Nelson. crazy. This is probably two of the hardest hitting guys in WTF wrestling about to go at it for the United Continental title. This is going to be something. And it's for the WTF United Continental Championship. Ready? Oh, hey, look at that guy. It's the boss. Oh, oh he's yeah. a referee now. Look at that. Go you know, finish. times is hard. The pandemic did a lot. It did. All right, here we go. They're, they're circling the ring now. Nightmare's going to have the power edge as to where Happy will, Happy will have the advantage. And Nightmare clearly has the power advantage. Oh. Nightmare talking a little smack. Hey, I've been in the ring with that guy. Uh, you don't want to talk no smack to an angry clown. We all it's know not, that, that, that That doesn't really end well. This is what we call an episode. Uh, we're barely getting all right. started here. And they're tying up. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yep, there you go. There goes Happy. No. Ringing that arm. Trust me, I know what that feels like, right. and it's not Wait. fun. Got that oh thing synced in there. It is Real locked nice. and loaded. It is locked in. Up oh, there it is. I'm switching hammer. Uh oh. And up oh, and he reverses. Oh, in reverse. Uh, oh. Ooh, right. Clubbing blow to the back. Oh and ooh. ooh. All right. Oh. Pull the hair. Pull the hair. Told you. You told you. You don't want to get that clown mad. You don't want to get that guy mad. Watch up, Come nice down. arm ringer. Up, up, up. Manipulating arm. those yeah. joints. That's what Happy oh, likes to oh, do. There we go. I think Nightmare needs Will to go for them ropes there, go Daddy. For the rope. Will he make it? Oh, now Happy's now Happy's just toying with him. He's just toying with him now. This, 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 this is not good. Classic Happy. This is not this good. Is Happy's he element. is toying with him. Oh. Up, oh, all right, Happy lets him go. All right, he lets him go. A little reprieve for Nightmare. Uh, not for long, though. Happy back to manipulating that arm. He goes. He's dragging down Nightmare. What is he going to do? He's going to transition into something crazy. I already know what it's going to be. Oh, Nightmare reverse. Oh! Wicked shot. That'll wake you up. Against the ropes. What a clothesline. You see, everyone, he is nothing. Oh. Oh. Uh-oh. A lot of smack oh, there oh, from oh. the big guy. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Break down. That's a gift that keeps on giving, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, oh. <laughs> I think I want to return that gift. Three, two, one, two, two. That was definitely a two count, Mr. Nightmare, count. sir. You might want to relax yourself. Easy Soften easy. that clown up for me when we go and take the belts from him. That's how you're supposed to get him. Yeah, yeah. What a oh. Jesus Christ snap suplex from Nightmare. Whoa. And down goes. Soften that clown up. Is it? it. Whoa, what was that? A, what the hell? That was a two over. count? That was a two count. That was a two it's count? Two count, it's not over. Thank God, Carol, thank God. Yeah, we, we need more people like you. I thought that was three. No, yeah. I counted. All right, now, uh, oh, rear, rear chin lock. Ooh. Nightmare is going very, uh, well, well, Happy does have 20 years in the business, and so does Nightmare. This is. They're both vets in the game. Yeah, they really are. This is, this is really. This is really what we like to call in Mexico, a clásico. See. Si. Yes, nephew, you were supposed to back me up. Thank you, Caroline. Why are you backing me up, man? I'm enjoying the match. Man, man you, you, you need to be taking notes for when we whoop his ass. I am taking notes. You should be, because you know, you know, you know, we, we, you know they, they wouldn't let me do the ride. They wouldn't let us do the ride to the top, but we could still get those tag team belts. We definitely still. Oh, you guys can. 
Oh, oh my deep the forearms. Oh, okay. Wow. Nightmare oh, coming for blood. Oh, to the turnbuckle. He's charging. Oh. oh. Nobody home. Making out for the turnbuckle. Welcome to an episode of Oh my god, the angry happy mailman ah. said, How's this? Hitting them. Uh oh. Oh, and Trapping there. once again, happy going back into that arm. He's going there back into go. that arm. Come back. Gonna go. Oh! oh! I have been on the other side of that, and I can tell you firsthand from personal experience, that's not fun. It's not fun. I tried to blind the man with his vest, and he still wound up hitting me. Mm. Trust me, well, one thing I will say about the clown is when he is laser focused, he's laser focused. Now, Nightmare, come on, man. What are you doing? Let's see, will he defend it or will he lost? I don't want to cheer for neither one of you, honestly, but I'm trying to win those belts. So, Nightmare, you gotta, you gotta do something. Oh my oh. cheek! Whoa! Mm -mm. Somebody need to get that man some Vaseline because his arm is going to Ooh. ash up. Ladies and gentlemen, that rope is not your friend. Okay? Yeah. Happy going for the shoulder. Ooh. He's gonna need some tiger bomb yeah, after he this. Real, yeah, <laughs> yeah. He's gonna need some tiger bomb after this. Yeah. Tiger bomb saves lives, ladies yes, and gentlemen. Do. Don't be sleeping on it. Don't sleep on no tiger bomb. That has saved me plenty of time, I tell you that right now. <laughs> but here come Happy. What is he gonna, oh! Oh, oh. Now he's just oh, unleashing oh, oh. an onslaught, a, a barrage of punches, oh if you will. Gosh. And now he's choking this man out. He's not letting him breathe. And now he's going back into the arm again. Is Happy going for a submission? I think oh. Has he added something new to his arsenal that we should be afraid of, even though I am Ace El Cero Miedo? Don't look at me like that. You need to focus on the match, sir. Don't look at me like that. Okay, it's getting good. Let's see. It's getting good. I'm, I'm taking notes. If Happy doesn't do a submission, I'm going to be very angry. <laughs> no, it looks like he, Happy does have a game plan. He, is, he, he does up. have it. He's working on that arm, and Nightmare oh. is not letting it happen. Oh, 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 the bad arm. The bad arm. Oh, yeah. He's still getting it done. He's still making it work. Bad arm and everything. Not over. Another two count. Another two. You know, I, I think I need to talk to, to our illustrious boss. He needs to count a little faster. Uh, <laughs> just a little. Just, just a tad just bit. Just a little bit. He's giving you don't got to do an Earl Hebner fast count, but you know, don't be slow like Bob Armstrong. <laughs> oh, oh no, God knows that man is slow as hell. That oh. man is slow. And they're counting. Oh, now they're counting. Here we go. Five, you know what they say, the person that gets up six, first has the most momentum, and it's seven, Nightmare. Seven. He got him on the ropes. Down. Picking him up now. Oh, the second rope. Oh, oh, yeah. Here we go. Sinking that choke in there. Get there, Mr. Referee. Oh, oh. oh he's coming. Oh. He's, oh. Woo! That is not a Calvin Klein model. That is one big son of a bitch. Nightmare's a very big guy. Oh yeah. Oh my god, that's 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 a very big dude. That's yeah. no look. that's no supermodel. That's always oh, <laughs> look anybody that has has oh, had, like, stories that I've heard about that guy. Look, they, that man has uh he's, he's, he has he has quite an, an impressive track oh. record, if you will. Now he is uh he is decimating this poor old clown. I almost kind of feel sorry. Oh, I almost kind of feel sorry for the man. And oh my oh, god, completely Lord. no soul, grabbing him by the Ooh. nose. Now he's chopping. Woo! This is a beautiful thing. Beautiful sight to oh. behold. Oh, shit. oh. Hey, that's a middle finger Steve Austin would love. Indeed. <laughs> oh! Got him. Happy is coming back. Wow! That's what we talk about. Ooh. Uh -oh. oh, he's going to the top. Something he doesn't do often. Knee drop up. Doesn't. Nightmare out of the way. Not there. It's kind of like when you get an Uber Eats delivery and you think you're going to deliver that thing and they say, oh, you didn't bring it, sir. And you deliver it to the wrong address. Oh, now yeah. Oh, my go. God. There it goes. 
No, he reversed it. Oh, wait, wait. Happy reversed it. Oh, shit. I wasn't that fast oh, last shit. time. Wait, wait. Oh. Oh, my God. There it goes. DDT, that shit. Reverse DDT. It is. Whoa. Is Happy wins. Over. Oh. Wow. Who would have? Wow. Happy reversed the. new. Happy reversed the pump handle. And he hits him with the reverse DDT. I have felt four of those, so I know firsthand how that feels. I think I still have a little concussion from after those uh, have a few sting marks from those chops I took. Wow. But they are not. <laughs> what a beautiful piece of illustrious wrestling that has been um, portrayed in front of you guys tonight. Yeah. The clown. Uh, uh, actually surprised me. I'm, I, I'm gonna clap for that. I mean, impressed. That victory. <laughs> I am quite impressed. impressed. <laughs> that slippery he, slip he, out of the move. He got a, I ain't Perfect. even mad. Um, <laughs> it's just a crying shame that he's gonna lose uh, one, well, two, because he's gonna lose those tag belts. <laughs> I mean. <laughs> he's definitely gonna lose them tag belts, but, um, Happy don't know nothing about Bad Boy for Life. Yeah, he don't know nothing about the BB for Life, did he? Bad Boy, that's right. Ah, oh, the name, bra. You, both of you guys suck. Uh, well, looks like he's got more Nightmare, in Nightmare his is taking his loss fair and square, and Happy the Clown thinks he's a belt collector. But let you know now, sir, enjoy those titles while you can. Enjoy your little Illuminati triangle that you're doing. Enjoy all your little smack talk that you're doing because come the next live event, two of those belts sitting in front of you that make your triangle will be coming home to the most good from Hollywood and the man that knows how to play my man RJ, the BB for life who we coming for him. So I'm coming for him. I'm coming for everything. I'm coming yeah, for the belt. All right, guys, that was a great match. I remember that. That was last year. But still, since yeah. then, you've been a, a fighting champion. Yeah. In... Let's be honest. Nobody's challenging me. Let's, be, let's, let's, let's keep it real. Nobody's really going after me. And the reason why is me. Let's, let's, keep the front, let's keep it straight up. All the Tylers, Power Rangers, Billy Blades, Angelo Vegas, whatever. They all talk a whole good game. But the reality is the two most dominating forces, and I'm going to toot his horn because he deserves it, is the world's champion and me. Nobody has come to our level. Why do you think I chose him for the title? Why do you think I was going to choose Angelo Fat, Angelo Vega? The, this guy is too busy worrying about calling somebody a bucket of AIDS than doing what he has to do as, a, as, a, as the universal champion. And that's not, I'm not going to get into that. The fact is, is that since I became the title, no one stepped up. Y'all talk crap on this show, but I don't see no contracts. I don't get the emails. I get nothing. So what did I do? I win a battle royal. I've set my own fucking destiny to go after the world's champion. And you know what's going to fuck up? You know what's going to be really fucked up? No, I said, when I become the world champion again, it's going to be the same thing that happened in, at that time when I was champion before. No one will challenge me. And you're very confident that you're going to most likely beat the uh, Chris Angel. You got to be. Mm -hmm. You got to be. Why are you going to half step with a guy like that? I've seen what he's have done. He's he going is, around he's collecting. Built, he's collecting titles like nothing. He's built quite a repertoire. You know, mm -hmm. and I'm not going to like say he's a piece of cake or whatever. This is going to be a fight. Mm -hmm. And the only, only thing that he should know about, I love a good fight. Wow. Indeed. So with that, speaking of fight, we're going to hear from the two participants of this so-called debate <sighs> for tomorrow night or Friday night, I should say. I yeah. think it'll be more, bene more, more beneficial than the presidential debate, right, I guess. I'm sure on Friday night, Carolyn, you'll be doing smoking weed. I don't know if you want to be present for this. I don't know. Should I? Should yeah. I bring out the whiskey and weed? <laughs> All right, so let that, let's check out uh, from both Tyler Cage and Angelo V. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Tyler Cage. And for those of you have not been watching, for those of you that have been asking, 
Well, look no further. Finally, you all get what you want. Even though I don't give a shit what you guys want. But it seems like Angelo Vega has called me out. So, after all the talks, after all the BS that's been going on for the past few weeks, past few months, it's finally happening. Yours truly, Tyler Cage, is gonna go face to face with the icon, the WTF Universal Champion, the rise to the top briefcase holder, Angelo Vega. And if you think what you saw in the previous months, the previous weeks, look no further till next week. And Angelo Vega, I'll be looking forward to this face-to-face -face confrontation with you because you're gonna have nobody to blame but yourself. When I finally expose the dents in your armor and the entire world will witness it. I'll see you then. Hey everyone, this is the WTF Universal Champion, Angelo Vega, with a quick reminder. Tomorrow night, this Friday, tomorrow night, Vincent Cage, you better fucking show up to this debate we're going to have, or else it's just going to get worse for you. I'll see you tomorrow. Those are some very powerful words from each candidate. What do you think? Well, again, like I said, these are some very powerful words from each candidate. I can't say fighter since this is a debate. Debate, face-off, whatever it is. Cordera, master debaters. So what do you think, master Happy the Clown? Debate. What I think about this, I might as well go and watch golf or see flies fuck. This is, makes no fucking sense at all. This is a little before SmackDown, everybody, for those who have watched. Formula One's more entertaining. Yeah, I'm being honest. This is so, this is this like, oh, we're going to have a debate. Why? Because somebody caught their feelings. Another one wants to be a big mouth and talk about AIDS and shit like that. Get in the ring and fight. Shut the fuck up. Jesus fucking Christ. This is what we do on our Friday nights, right? Having two guys debate. Debate. Master debaters. All right, so tomorrow night, people, on Friday night, actually, on extremely uh, exclusively on YouTube. Exclusively on YouTube. So that's Friday, June 14th, 7 p.m. Eastern, 4 p.m. Pacific. Yes. Right before SmackDown that's, and Easter. That's right. I'm going to probably be worrying about doing some chicken and dicking. I know there's a 50 bucket waiting my name on it. Mm. All right, so don't miss it tomorrow for those who are intrigued by this. All right, so don't miss it. I mean, I'm just stuttering right now because I just can't wait to show you this. Uh, the whole Vanna White thing. Going yes. On. So without wasting any time, here's a few fun facts about this. You know, the championships have been here since 2015. Only yeah. seven champions so far. Yeah. No two-time champions yet. No. But you're the seventh champion. Mm-hmm. You know, so. Glory be. <laughs> yeah. You know, so, I know we, we have different designs of the United Continental Championship. You don't yeah. get me wrong. And it's supposed to be, you know, the United States Championship and the Intercontinental Championship Together. combined. Yeah, yeah. If they had a baby, like Caroline would mm -hmm. say, right? Yeah if they pretty much merged. Yes. So it's a might. nice little hybrid. So with that, let's check out this uh, hardwood. You want to do the honors, Caroline? Yeah, sure. Brrr. Here you go. Ta-da. Holy shit. They finally did something right. Oh, never mind. I'm not going to say that out loud. <laughs> no, come on. No, be honest. Ooh, see this. What do you think? Has a good weight. Nice color. Got the WTF logo on it. Ha-ha. <laughs> It's not the size of somebody's fucking body. <laughs> and shit, nah, this is what a championship should look like. This is what we at WTF should have. Yes. Definitely loving the detailing. Yeah, I do. So, yeah, the crew is here. So what do you think of the championship right here? Fucking awesome. Yeah. Let me put it back up here. There you go. Yeah, so right here, it looks perfect. Yes. yes, so as you can see, everybody up close, it is the United Continental Championship. So Nine years in the making, if you really think yeah. about it, though. So yeah. that being said, I am going to do something I should have done 
a long time ago. And, and that next? is? At the WTF United Continental Champion, at the next taping, I'm challenging anyone to get off their ass and get in the ring with me. Don't disappoint me. Yeah, we are doing more wrestling matches coming up. For those who have been asking, finally we're going to get that together. Yes, we're finally... In the summer, too. If, you, if anybody really wants to check this out, you know, message us and we'll, we'll, we'll get back to you about it, you know, so... Yeah, don't be shy, but you're definitely throwing your hat in the ring for this. Well, he is the champion. Well, he is, but he's really throwing his... He's throwing the invitation out. Like there. anybody that wants to wrestle. Yes, again, it's Happy to Clown. And he's not an easy person to beat, defeat. No, this is definitely a level that everybody wants to cross. So, so this is a nice level. What are you thinking about, Caroline? No, I love it. I'm loving the details. I'm loving the blue. Okay, I was about to say something weird, but I'm not going to go loud with it. I will talk to the promoter about this idea, but it's something I always wanted to do. And we're going to have a talk about it. I'm not going to say, this is what I want, this is what I want. Unlike some people in this fucking company, you know who you are. I have an idea for you. We'll talk about it later. Mm -hmm. And we'll surprise everyone with this idea. Okay. All right. Cool. No problem. We'll definitely um, see if we can work this out. But definitely we're going to wrap this up. And, and before we go, first things first, uh, we are looking to do a women's division, not sex division. No, women. just more straight women's wrestling division. Yeah, we never had a WTF Women's Championship. So we're looking to do that So in the next couple of months. So if anybody interested, email me or DM me through WTF Wrestling, and we'll work from there. So what do you think of that idea? About fucking time. Yeah. Okay. WT WTF Wrestling has been around for 30 years, and we haven't done a women's title yet. All that and no women? Yeah. yeah. Total sausage fest for 30 years. <laughs> yeah, that's like a real long jail sentence, right? Or a very long fraternity. Yeah. Axe him. All right. I know. Anyway, so also make sure you follow us on our social media, right, Caroline? Yep, like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, check us out on Instagram, and also thank you for tuning in once again. If you're watching this on YouTube, like, subscribe, share, and hit that bell for notifications every time we give you new WTF Wrestling or WTF TV live content. All right, there you go. All right, thank you, Mr. Happy to Clown, and um, we yeah, glad yeah. we're able to show off this new championship. It's mine. <laughs> <laughs> so he's going to defend it very soon, so don't miss it, guys. For that, we'll see you guys next week in an all-new episode of Wrestling Outlaws, and it's something you don't want to miss. Yep. All right, have a good night. Night.